Hey guys, just want to do a quick uh, video on these. Uh, so uh, I picked these a little bit early, unfortunately. But this is a, a loquat for those that have never seen them, you know. Uh, now they definitely get a little more uh, orange than this. So they're yellow now. And you can see there's a little bit of green in there. Now, ideally, you want them to sit on the tree maybe another three, four days. And they'll start to get a little more, yeah, instead of this yellow look, like a like more of an orange look. Uh, and your green will essentially be gone. Now, you can eat them like this, and they're still delicious. And uh, that's why I want to show you... Uh, Kind of what they look like on the inside now there's a few different ways to eat it you can eat it with the skin um, but sometimes i like to peel the skin it really depends and you can just grab it with your tooth and peel it back so see it's just like that Sorry to be a little gross here, guys. Spitting out those pieces, but I'm trying to work with one hand. But that's what the flesh looks like on the inside. Super juicy, sweet, sour. I'm trying to think what kind of a, a fruit it compares to. Mm. You get a little flavor of like maybe citrusy mango the skin is maybe like a very thin skinned mango like I wouldn't eat a mango skin but you could definitely eat this skin because it's very thin but not much flavor in the skin a little bit a little sour But the flesh is delicious, juicy, refreshing. Now you have some pretty big seeds on the inside. Pop those out for you. So this particular one has four seeds. And you could eat the whole thing, but I usually leave the bottom, so I just eat around it. Mm. A really, really delicious fruit. If you don't have a loquat tree and you can grow it in your area, definitely plant it. And the reason why I think it's a wonderful tree is it's actually beautiful. It's a very nice looking tree, even if it didn't bear any fruit. It's such an exotic, nice looking tree that it's worth having just for the looks. But to top it off, it produces delicious, attractive practically pest-free um, fruit to top it off. It's just a win-win. The only thing is you have to be in a, a fairly warm region. I think you got to be probably maybe zone 7 uh, or warmer. And zone 7, maybe you'll, you'll have to protect it a little bit. I grew these in zone 7B, uh, and they did great. I never had to cover it, never had any issues. I'm now in zone 9B, and it does really well, but uh, to be honest with you, sometimes the extreme sun can uh, get the leaves to brown up a little bit. Just a little bit, you'll notice it. So these probably would do best in zone 7, 8, 9A, and definitely on up. I mean, it, it does well in a hot place, but a little more sensitive to the extreme sun if you live like in the desert. Uh, when it's a very young tree, but definitely still plant it. Wonderful variety to add. This is the Gold Nugget uh, Loquat. Delicious fruit. Well, that's it for now, guys. So we'll see you in the next one.